Hello and welcome back, my Sam Squanches. How you doing today on this wonderful, wonderful day? It's Chris here, and uh, we're gonna be playing the new uh, world, uh, Borealis, the new, the first new map on the first new world. So, uh, if you guys probably remember Sagon One and then Ascendar, they're making entirely two, ten new maps right here. So a big update uh, for this game, and they don't, they, when they go for an update, man, they go big. They don't just like throw out like a new map here and a new map there. No, like they're going all the way on us, guys. We got three new heroes. We've got Roy. We've got Sparus. We've got Blue Dragon. I'm um, gonna be using Roy today because he's one of the cheapest heroes. And then we're gonna kind of go through and just play with everybody just to sort of have fun with them and everything, and hopefully level them up as well. Because right now he's level seven, I believe. All right, let's play Icebreaker. So this is a weird one. Uh, I just practiced it once, and uh, it was pretty difficult. We are playing Impossible, by the way, or Impossible. And that means that uh, uh, it's not going to be easy. All right, so what we're going to do is uh, basically you got to go hard on these things. So we're going to, first of all, buy these defenders really quick. One, two, and soon to be three. We're going to send everybody all the way up over here as fast as we possibly can. We're going to drop the drop turret over here to defend. We're going to hopefully get these thir this third one pretty soon over here as well. But basically, what we want to do is we want to push up as fast as we possibly can. So we're going to kind of push this guy all the way up over here. we got to defend these mofos right here. The ones on the far right there. You don't, I don't even think you can actually um, target them. Alright, so put him all the way up the top here. We're going to make him a mecha. And we're going to send everybody else uh, kind of just right behind them over here. And we're going to try and kill everybody as fast as we possibly can. Now, of course, try and stay away from, if, if at all possible, try and stay away from any of these little spores right here. Because they will explode the crap out of everything. So here's the third one already. Well, boom. We've got to spend our Ethereum, guys. Don't think that there's nothing to spend it on. No, you can spend it on a crap ton of stuff. Use your abilities. Do everything you can to take these guys down. I think once you get about ten guys going, though, that's when the game starts to change a little bit. It's going to be a little bit more difficult for us. So the next thing we're going to do is let's get a good defense going. So we're going to get a nice laser turret over here. And we're going to upgrade them up pretty gosh darn high, too. All right, let's throw some firebombs on these guys. The firebomb comes back very quickly, by the way, so make sure you're using that as much as you possibly can. Even if you're not looking at Roy, just use the firebombs, dude. Just use them up. Use another firebomb. And it's time for a laser. Also, what I need to do is I need to get some of these guys going. So, let's do our best. So you, as you can see, we are taking down all these guys up here. Perfect. Keep them away from your Yorgsmorgs. Some more monsters up in here, man. It's going to be very upsetting if you lose some Yorgsmorgs. But here we go. We got a bunch of new stuff going on. We've got the Gar, the Gar Warhol. They're just they're the names, man. I'm never gonna get these down. The Gar Warhol with the apostrophes and crap in them. Like holy crap! It's an allied structure that we can make the uh, the ice guys with. So um, it's nice, but it's weird because you they're they're exponentially more expensive as you get more. Uh, it kind of makes sense because like the more you get, the stronger you're gonna be. Obviously, exponentially strength. So here we go. We got ten of them. They're like protect the rest. So what we need to do is now we need to move over to the uh, the right over here. All right. We're hoping that those bottom four will still make it. We're gonna move over to the actually the left. Excuse me. Move over to the left over here, and we're gonna still try to buy as much crap as we can. You can see there's still some guys on the far right over there. In fact, I'm gonna pick Roy up. I'm gonna drop him over here. Hopefully, we can ki just kill this guy real quick. Just get rid of him. You know. But he is tanky as crap with that shield right there. All right. We're going to move this guy up into the top. Where, what do we got going on down here? Uh, Roy is dead. All right. So Roy just officially died over there. So the guys are going to be coming in pretty hard on us now. But here we go. You can see the big group of units coming from the top up here. we got to kill these guys quickly. Let's get our, uh, our few little upgrades over here. And what we're going to do is we're going to buy a uh, machine gun turret down here to help ourselves defend just a little bit. All right, let's push everybody up. There's still some more. Oh, there's some Yorksmorgs coming in over here. we got to defend, boys. we got to defend. They're dying. Let's get Roy over there. Defend, Roy. Roy, drop him down. Come on, Roy. Get him protected. Get him protected, boy. And with everybody combined together, we hopefully should be able to defend over here. we got some Yor more Yorksmorgs coming in over here as well. going to move these guys back just a little bit. We protected. We protected. Oh, they're getting in my base right now, though. They are killing my Yorksmorgs. All the Yorksmorgs are dying. Let's let's kill the spores here. Let's explode some spores while we're at it. Ba boom. The Yorksmorgs are dying everywhere. <laughs> Actually, the the enemies are dying. The Yorksmorgs are surviving everywhere, which is exactly what we want. All right, what's next on the agenda here, guys? I'm thinking about just getting some extra upgrades with everything. 
All right. So where are they coming from now? Any more York Smorgs? We'd have to use Roy and our uh, our guys over here to run, to run through to wherever I need to kill them all. Oh crap! We've got these uh, these flamers over here. Those are not fun to have to deal with. Oh no, the York Smorgs! York Smorgs, go over here! Defend the York Smorgs! There he is. Ba boom! No, they're gonna die! Oh god, they died. They're burning to a crisp. Alright, let's also send these bad boys over here as well. We take down some of the flamers. They are strong as crap, though. Oh boy, are they. They're gonna explode all of the York Smorgs. Oh god! Oh, I hate it! I hate it! <laughs> Alright, so with our extra money over here, hopefully this guy survives. I have no idea if they're going to. Uh, we still got our three things going on. These guys. Oh, this guy's almost dead. Let's move him back just a little bit. We still need to, to have about ten more survive. That's where we're at right now, guys. Ten more need to survive. So, here we go. The York Smorgs are dying over here. We gotta pick up Roy and drop him over here. Oh, they're everywhere, dude. They're everywhere. There's no way they're going to survive. There's no way. We'll do our best, though. There's a few of them. There's one of them going to make it through, I think. But I don't think that one's going to make it. He's running the wrong way. He's running the wrong way. And, uh-oh, we lost a mecha, so we got to rebuild a mecha for sure, man. We can't, have, we can't go without a mecha over here, so let's push him up to the top over here. We'll go double mechas over there and just kill these flame guys. Um, Alright, so we kind of have to back up here for a second, guys. We got 30 through. We just need 10 more to follow up. Alright, get off his freaking lawn, dude. Get off his freaking lawn. I got no tankers right now, though. We need to explode these spores on him as much as we possibly can. The York Smorks are again dying over there. There's nothing I can do about it, though. Absolutely nothing I can do. There's like ten of them coming in, but they're all going to die. Oh, it's awful. All right, let's spend some more monies on these things. Looks like it will end up dying right there. We're going to rebuy it. And boom, we explode a lot of them. Roy ends up dying anyways, though. All right, so our two mechas over here doing nothing. There's four more coming from the left over here. I think we can defend those pretty pretty safely. 32 of them are, are officially through here, but there's a lot of guys coming in right now. We're going to switch them back to a shell storm, so our shell storm can run just a little bit faster. They're coming in hot, though, dude. Let's get some repair on this thing. Roy's just about back. We just about got this thing back. But boom, drop it in. Drop it in. Drop Roy in. Take him down, boys. Take him down. They're coming in from the top as well. They're coming in everywhere. There's huge jumbles of them everywhere. Oh, my God. There's the... Oh, here's the last four Yorgish Morms coming in from the top left. Can we defend them long enough? We're just going to have to use our elixir as efficiently as possible can with some of these uh, Marines. Get them in the way. Run the York Smorgs through. Run the York Smorgs through. Come on, we just need three of them. Go, little York Smorgs. Go. Go, little buddies. And we protect the York Smorgs. I think. I think that means we win. I hope that means we didn't lose. Oh, my God. Victory is ours. Holy crap, dude. That was freaking intense right there. All I heard was... Vroom. And by the way, I was about to build a, uh, a machine gun turret to keep my um, refinery alive. Uh, basically, if you build a, a, a machine gun turret, it's, it stops the guys from being able to kill your refinery, which is sort of a weird way to sort of cheat the game out of existence a little bit, but it ended up working out for us, man. Absolutely intense. Absolutely insane. I can't even call this a guide video. I can just call it a Wii 1 video. But it is not impossible, so it makes sense that this is just ridiculously difficult. Uh, and I'm playing with Roy, which I gotta be—I gotta be straight, with you guys. I'm not a huge fan of Roy so far. All right, so far is probably the key word. Uh, so I'm gonna switch on over. We're gonna try out Sparus for my next video uh, for the Space Invaders. All right, 
so uh, yeah, a lot of new things going on. Uh, you know, I don't think I mentioned this, by the way, but I think there's three new upgrades all the way in your tech tree, so make sure you do upgrade those guys. There's the hybrid materials, the scalable systems, and the bomb gun. And this thing you've already seen already, basically it allows you to unlock a third level, or a second and a third level, for your turret abilities. Before, turrets just got one ability uh, for each side, and that was it. Now you can upgrade those abilities to second tier and third tier abilities, which is more of a tower defense type game, which I actually really enjoy. Uh, and you can probably do this on any level, too, not just Borealis level. So this will actually be uh, more fun to use those things. Um, so if you guys enjoyed, press that like button for me. Much, much appreciated. Subscribe if you haven't, and have a super duper delicious day.